What happened to Grace and Lace after Shark Tank? The television show Shark Tank provides a platform for interpreters to pitch your business ideas to a panel of investors. For Rick and Melissa Hinnant, a couple from Texas, their company Grace and Lace was born out of personal tragedy when they lost their daughter. Afterwards, Melissa ended up being confined to bed rest. During this time, she knitted a pair of boot socks, which became the first product of their new business. The couple posted their products on Etsy and sold over 50,000 pairs within two years, which encouraged them to pitch her company on Shark Tank. They're able to secure a deal with Barbara Corcoran and experienced a massive surge in sales with over $1 million in sales in just five days after the episode aired. Since then, the company has averaged $15 million in annual sales, allowing the Hinnants to fulfill a promise of charity work. Melissa and Rick showcase her business, Grace and Lace, on an episode of the Shark Tank in Season 5. The couple had started the business with only $800 and had already sold 50,000 pairs of the product without accumulating any debt. During the pitch, they asked for $175,000 in exchange for 10% of their business. Robert Herjavic was eager to invest, but Barbara managed to convince a couple to partner with her instead, offering the same deal, but with half the money given as a line of credit. The Hinnants agreed to work with Barbara, and the business has since expanded from selling boot socks to a variety of clothing items like sweaters, jackets, and pants. Grace and Lace has been very successful with overall sales reaching $47 million by 2019. In addition to their business success, Melissa and Rick have used her profits to build 13 entrepreneurs in India. Their inspiring story of turning tragedy into prosperity and giving back has made it one of the best feel-good stories on Shark Tank. All the products sold by Grace and Lace can now be purchased throughout their website.